Hmm. I'd like to know what they're discussing. I can't understand what they're saying. Perhaps I can open that window up there a little wider. This is the way to Colonel Travers' office. No, I'm supposed to wait here. Oh, dear. The window is slightly open. I can hear Colonel Travers and Graham talking, although not clearly. A dustbin full of rubbish. The stench is foul. Hey, who'd want to throw away a perfectly good potato? A cellar window. One of the bars is bent. Hmm. A bar broken off a grating. Through the application of the lever law and a great deal of brute force, <coughs> the bar is mine. A newspaper from last week. Cobblestones. Very decorative. A black automobile. Mr. Graham brought me here in it. A long branch. It looks as though it may be a bit rotten. I'll take the branch. Hey! The stupid crow won't let me. Well, will you let me? Hey, very aggressive. Hmm, I'll scatter the potato on the ground. Perhaps I can lure the crow that way. Wonderful. I can't get at the window sash. The branch is a bit too short. The bar is much too short. Hmm. If I push the hollow end of the bar firmly on the branch, I'll have something resembling a spear. Ha! Huh. Now I can push the window open a bit wider. I can't wait to hear what they're talking about. What are you doing, Professor? Uh, I... Come along, we're going. Right now? Will your colleagues inform my housekeeper? Yes, we mustn't lose any time. Our contact in Berlin has already been informed. The journey to Berlin was arduous, but not as dangerous as I thought it'd be. The journey was without incident. I hope the rest of the mission is just as simple. John, this is Schmidt, our contact. This is Professor Russell. A pleasure. Quiet now. My delivery van is over there. Back there is the entrance to the KWI. KWI? The Kaiser Wilhelm Institute. This is where the plans we showed you came from. How does it look, Schmidt? 
There are two guards by the entrance, but I don't know how many are in the building. Hmm. How many ways in? Well, the fence is locked. The windows are all shut. Of the doors, only the main entrance is not connected to the alarm. Very well, then. We'll go through the main entrance. We'll wait and see if the guards go off to the bathroom or something. John, make yourself comfortable back there in the delivery van for now. All right. Hmm. Maybe I can distract the guards. Soldiers with weapons. The delivery van's radiator is behind this cover. A slip of paper. Looks like a note or a shopping list. Hmm. A thin rubber hose. Schmidt must use it to pour his chemicals into bottles. I'm sure I can do something with it. A box with all manner of chemicals. But there is a lot in there. Let me just take a bottle of spirits. Spirit is derived from the Latin for breath. There's still more in the crate. Soft soap. Cleans quickly and thoroughly. Citrus extract. And everything smells fresh and new. Rock salt. For especially tough stains. A pencil. Freshly sharpened. These Germans. Stain remover. I assume it only removes the stain, not what's under it. An empty glass bottle. Hmm. Ferrous sulfate. A disinfectant. There's nothing else useful in there. A bottle with a large mouth. The hose fits well in the bottle. Now I can siphon the water. So, the water is even still a bit warm. Hmm. Well, in it goes. Well, in it goes. Hydrochloric acid. I must be careful, it's very corrosive. Excuse me. Yes? What should we do now? We wait and we watch. What if the guards don't go away? Then Graham will think of something. Can I borrow things from the delivery van? Go ahead. However, you won't be able to do much with most of the stuff. Thanks, anyway. Here, take my pocket knife. A pocket knife is always useful. Thank you, Schmidt. Schmidt. What's it like living in Berlin? We have little to eat. We are frightened by the bombing raids, and we hope the war will be over soon. I guess it's the same here as back home in London. That's the war for you. Can't we just take out the guards? It's not that simple. If we cause even the slightest commotion, we will have the police, 
or worse, the Gestapo after us. Yes, but... Graham wants us to proceed quietly and secretly. I just thought... One should not kill people so frivolously, Professor. No, that isn't what I meant. All right. Why don't we climb over the wall? There are metal bars on top of the wall. It would take a ladder to get over. Yes, and? Three dark figures running about with a three-meter ladder. Hmm, that's not loud and conspicuous. Understood. Perhaps we should come back some other day. Never put off until tomorrow. Yes, yes, I understand. I'll keep looking around. Do that. Pebbles, slate or granite. I was never much good at lithology. Hmm. Who knows what I might be able to use them for? The hose is quickly tied. Ouch! John, what the... Eh? Hey, that's a good idea. Let me... But ah! Who's throwing? Ouch! Just wait. I'll get you, my friend. Very good. And now carefully up to the entrance. Schmidt, you keep an eye out here and cover our backs. Understood. Locked. I expected that. And now? I'll find out if we can get into the building another way. You go back to Schmidt and wait for me there. But... Go, go! The guards will be back soon. <laughs> 